Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. We are back with another episode of NBA 2K18 My Career from YMD Gentle's channel. Now, check this out guys. In this video, I'm going to be reacting to it, but I'm also going to be giving you guys my thoughts about how the video is playing out. If you guys look at it, it says NBA debut, playground free roam, and maxing out your my player with VC. So we get a lot of information in this video. And this video is much shorter than most of his episodes from this uh, entire like series for the pre-released gameplay now one big thing if you guys want to check out the original video make sure you guys check out the link inside the description make sure you guys subscribe to the channel make sure you guys like this video as well and let's dive in yo what it do youtube it's your boy jen toe episode six in the nba 2k18 my career series man you guys have been showing so much love and this was supposed to be six and seven but i feel like you guys have waited long enough so here we go i don't know if you guys seen any free roam so in the beginning of this episode you're gonna see me just playing around i'm gonna finally change my name because i know a lot of people are like wait he's not a playmaker three-point specialist he's a whatever the name is and as you see right here i think this is the 2v2s no it's five spots no it's not but there's different areas in the playground like you're going to see an area for the 3v3s uh the 2v2s are somewhere in the cut as we approach this foot locker i didn't go inside guys i was somewhat rushing because if you caught the end of the vlog series that's when the security turned on the lights and they were telling everybody they gotta go then luckily my boy ymd mario came in and said nah gento do your thing get some extra footage for everybody watching back home and i said you know what appreciate it you're the real mvp but i like this man one thing i do gotta say is it's huge you're really gonna have to grind to get that skateboard the bike and all that stuff and i was joking on twitter right this is dope but imagine nba 2k19 where you gotta grind and purchase your first car and remember like previously we had three parks what if there was three different towns like you got the original actually four you got this playground and then they're gonna bring back sunset rivet and old town man it's like we're going to be playing gta 2k oh. <laughs> but i think you guys seen enough uh, one thing that i do want to show you your cell phone this year you're going to see objectives social media uh event calendars trivia squad up hey one thing that i can say uh real quick before we keep the video going 2k outdid themselves with the whole entire phone integration playground to game to back to playground to training you know what i'm saying where you can go if you guys notice he's at the playground and a game popped up for him to play so that's a really big step forward for 2k whereas though you kind of minimize all the crazy loading screens having to go back to my court to do this having to go to my park to do that having to go back to your my court to do this then having to go to walk on pro-am because sometimes pro-am wouldn't work traveling from the park or vice versa so you know what i'm saying this phone this phone gimmick is lit it's pretty lit and it's a lot of information to scroll through when you're going on your phone it's, it's just dope but take a look at this real quick it's so easy to navigate everything if you want to chill in the playground you could chill in the playground all right i see a couple uh badges quick reflexes free throw ace glue hands what else, what else was back there pick pick and popper that, that that's that was okay so we got a couple shooting badges here got a couple defensive badges here a couple uh dribbling and athletic badges okay okay Okay. You want to hop into your next game, you can just like that. And I don't think you guys seen this anywhere. I'm going to show you guys all the badges for a passing and ball handling primary with a three point shooting secondary. There's some new badges free throw ace, quick reflexes, uh, glue hands, or something like that. Guys, I told you earlier in the series that I was going to go and change my name. I finally found some downtime to change my name to Marcus Gento. I just had to do it. It just it just felt right. And I'm even going to slap some hair on this bald nugget. And it'll be talking about bald gods, man. Them baldy gods, nice. 
Nah, but uh, what do you guys think about the minimalistic uh, menus that 2K has brought to 2K18? It's not really too much extra when it comes to the menu format, but let's just look at it a little bit more. Some people were saying I look like Dave Chappelle. Some people said it looked like Cash Nasty. You guys were just going in. So I finally ended up changing my preset on the face. We got some hair now. All right, guys, I'm going to need you guys to really pay attention to this right here. Jump shots. Whatever jump shot you pick in the beginning, please, please, please make your decision wisely. Because if you want to change it, you're going to have to pay. As you guys see, 3500 for Steph Curry. I think Jordan was up here. I can't remember, but his was pretty expensive. 4000 when you could just get those for free. So if you want to save some VC, please take your time when you do those mm -hmm. shoot arounds. Crossovers. With and as you see right here, the crossovers, man. I said, hold up. Hold up, 2K. They changed it to like three different tiers. Some are one to two. It'll say normal or pro. And then I seen somewhere where it said 90 overall or 90 ball handling. You unlock elite moves. So that's interesting, too. After messing around in the My Player Lab, I said, okay, it's time for us to actually go inside of a store. I spent quite some time just exploring, man. I didn't even bother with the tattoo shop because they said you needed a, a high level or something. I'm, I'm level 60. So I said, you know what? Let's go inside Swags. Let's get rid of this brown rookie shirt. brown tee, this dookie brown t-shirt. And as you see, some clothing items are actually locked. So ranking up is a must you don't want to be a level 65 or a level 60 all year round you're gonna to have to grind get that vc up swipe that credit card whatever you got to do get that vc up so you can actually enjoy yourself this year in nba 2k18 and this is pretty cool you can try on your t-shirts they, they they just took this authenticity to like a whole nother level because usually you just hover over it and boom you you see it I'm actually trying on clothes in NBA 2K18. <laughs> I mean, you, you can just look at it on the picture, but the, the fact that you can try it on like this is real life is ridiculous. And as you see right there, you got two choices. You can either just buy it and then just store it for later, or you can buy it and wear it out. And I didn't realize it said wear it out. So as you see me exiting the store, I'm like, wait, what? What just happened? <laughs> Ooh, another thing I always loved about NBA 2K ever since the I think it was like 2K13 it introduced like blue diamonds or something so I had to check out the jewelry but most of the stuff is locked you guys are gonna see later spoiler alert I'm gonna upgrade my character that 65 overall was frustrating because every you spoil me so much gentle you spoil me like a little brat. Plus, I seen it in the title, so I kind of already knew he was going to max it out. Everything was locked. Literally, everything was locked. So, at this point, I decided to just go with whatever I had, which is going to be this yellow hoodie right here. Time was literally ticking. I did not have that much time left before security had enough of me my boy ymd mario couldn't bail me out anymore so i said you know what this is it it's time for us to get into our first game so i'ma let ernie shack and my boy kenny the jet smith take over from here it's the 2k sports pregame show oh wait, I, I really like this menu right here man NBA regular season opener for a couple of teams. Thank you all for tuning in. So happy you're here. I just, I mean, I'm ecstatic that you're here. And I I'm, miss and you I'm, too, And Ernie. I'm really happy that Kenny and Shaq are here, I too. I miss you, too, Ernie. Thank yeah, you. me, too. Why do these guys look like they're not even looking anywhere, like, at any teleprompter or a camera or nothing? they just like, yeah, I'm happy to be here. I smoked a big, big blunt in the back room. And I'm, I'm just glad that I could be here. <laughs> here we go, Rook. First game, boy. I remember my first game. I ain't gonna lie, man. I was a little man. Hey, Rook. Rook. What's up, man? You here, man? How geeked up are you? Nah, I'm just, I'm going over the give and go, man. I just want to make sure that when I'm in the back, I'm in the back. All right, all right, all right, all right. Move, okay, 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 get... okay. That's enough. That's enough, man. You my what, Rook, man? right? Yeah, yeah, I'm your Rook. We established you my rookie, right? I mean, you established it, but yeah, I know what you're trying All to say. Right, so listen up, man, because 
Look, I'm gonna be honest with you, all right? What? Number one, yeah. you're not even really gonna play. Man, get out of nah, here. Nah, man, that. for real. And on top of that, you are an unheralded rookie. You wasn't even drafted. So what? I'm hungry, all right? I've been working on my shot. I plugged in all my plays you on did 2K. What? what? Yeah, I plugged in all. Look, the point is, I've been putting my shots up. And let me tell you something. It is wetter than the Pacific Ocean on a rainy day, man. All right? <laughs> look, dog. So look, look, look. All right, all right, look. I love the enthusiasm, all right? Okay. I'm sure the coaching staff will even love it. You might as well sit back, relax, you no know, study the plays, maybe uh, pose your imaginary action figures or whatever you need to do. But I'm going to tell you, man, these dudes, us vets, we got this. Look, I am ready. All right, and I'm gonna prove it to you. Yeah, yeah, man, maybe so. All right, now, one thing that I noticed in this cutscene, if anybody's seen the video from my channel, um, I was playing 2K at the actual event, and it allowed me to play in the game. I wasn't sure what they were saying in the cutscene because I don't think I had subtitles on and it was very loud in the arena. But I was able to come in and play in the first game of the season up against Steph Curry and them. Um, I had like a slashing power forward post score or something like that. I can't remember the, the full build. But I was able actually to play. So I don't know if this is the same cutscene that you get the entire time or if it's a difference in your overall on if you get to play or not. So let's check it out. I know you feel that nostalgia. From NBA 2K14, the story in NBA 2K14 where it had the relationship between you, the rookie, and your mentor or whatever. Yeah, it feels like that's where they went with this one. And I guess I'll catch you guys in the game. I'm headed, I'm headed to the pre-game shoot around. One thing I will say is I'm not sure if you can change the camera of the pre-game shoot around, but I'm not complaining. The fact that 2K took this authenticity to like a whole nother level is beautiful. And I changed my jump shot. I actually paid for the Michael Jordan shot. It's much quicker, but hey, I'm, I'm enjoying it. I made all my shots so far as we go for the floater. And it gives you the full shot clock. So guys, man, wow. All I can say is wow. I'm impressed. I that like how the story quick. went back to being about you. The basketball life like there was nothing wrong with having your best friend Vic the uh, money hungry family the the girlfriend that actually did you dirty your best friend Denver having a baby all that off-court stuff was cool but they brought it back to the rivals remember we had a rival called Jackson Ellis how many of you guys remember Jackson Ellis now we got ATM we got our mentor, remember? I think it was, if it wasn't 2K14, it was 2K15. Because that's when they had all the NBA players reading scripts and stuff like that. But guys, my NBA debut, it's 57 to 40. We haven't got in yet. We haven't uh -oh. gotten any playtime yet. Now, this has me thinking, okay, is this just the way it is? Or is it because I messed up in the prelude? I did not get to play at all. Now Yikes. I'm a little upset. <laughs> I'm a little upset because security said this this is literally your last game, Gento. My boy Mario said, man, it is what it is, but what? And Chris Webber, this That's is Kevin Hart. Donut, 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 donut. Secret. Mm -hmm. That's how we do it, boo boo. That's right. Mm. Good game, Sam. Saw that victory, right? Killed him, man. <laughs> yeah, all right, all right, all right. Cringe. Too soon. What do you mean, too soon? Too soon, man. It's not your time yet. <sighs> you starting to embarrass me. What are you talking about? You have to stop. Mm. That's hilarious. All right, though. guys, before I go, there's two things I want to show you. Immediately after that game, if I wanted to, I could have gotten straight into my next game. You don't go to another loading screen. You literally have the choice to go back to another My Career game, or as you guys are about to see, I'm headed back to the playground. So I'm going to end this right here, guys. It kind of hurts me that I only had that little bit of time 
to actually record, but I made the best out of my time. I know it seems like <laughs> it's not enough. I'm going to try my best to get the full game for you guys. I'm definitely going to try to get it so we can continue way before release date. Your boy Gento got you, and I'm going to stop at nothing. So I'm just boosting things up. Take a look at this, though. As you boost your... Okay, um, I had to stop the video right here because Gento is currently at the last max out. Now, he can get to 85 overall, right? It's going to cost this man 190,000 VC to max his character at 85 without doing any extra playing, right? Now, remember, Gento has a ball handling shooter, which means his ball handling is first, his three-point shooting and, and other shooting is second. Check out my man Dunk. My man Dunk is only going to max out at eight bars. Mind you, he's 6'8". And he only get eight bars to dunk? Mm, I don't know, man. Now, post offense, understandable. You know what I'm saying? He's more of a shooter. But the three-point shot is not even higher than the ball handling. The mid-range shot is not even higher than the three-point shooting. <laughs> Goodness gracious, bro. He's he's a six eight passer. That's, that's what I really feel like. I feel like the three-point shooting is going to be there eventually, but... Like, as far as him knocking him down straight away, like, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. Now, stamina-wise, stamina's good. Acceleration's okay. Speed is okay. His lateral quickness is really, really bad. His lateral, that's that helps with the defense, man, being able to move your feet, being able to stay in front of people on defense. Man, I, I think if I call Gento with my shot-creating ball-handling point guard, at the park, and he was set up like this. He might get dropped off, man. I'm just, I'm just saying, Gento. I'm just saying. Your attributes. It still says level whatever. It doesn't give you an actual number rating, which is kind of disappointing, especially if you want to test out which archetype is for you. But it only costs 190k. And here, take a look at this. Here are all the things you unlock as you upgrade your overall, guys. All I want to say is thank you guys for all the love and support episodes one through six. Whenever I get the full game, I don't know, I guess we'll just start over from episode one with Marcus Gento. That's when the real grind begins. Slap that like button one time for your boy Gento. Subscribe if you're new. Thanks for... All right. Whatever. Um, one quick thing. I'm going to... Gento, I'm going to go ahead and... uh. Just mute you real fast. I just want to go over something real fast, man. Um, If we check out the ball handling, right? All right, so 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. All right, so at 21, right, he gets elite dribbling. At 21 bars, my man has elite dribbling, which means... He might have some heat moves. Now, as far as speed, let me see. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. But he can get up to about 22 bars of maxed out speed. I'm trying to figure out, is 22 bars enough to speed boost in NBA 2K18? Man, there's a lot, there's a lot to think about. When you're when you're going over to build, also his acceleration will also be 22, so they will both be maxed out at 22. So I'm trying to figure out if that's enough to speed boost in NBA 2K18. Now a lot of people know that the build that I'm creating has very good ball handling, very good uh, speed, and very good acceleration. But I want to know what it's like for small forwards as well. All right, pro level dribbling, shooting, and dunking, flashy. All right. A pre-game rituals, customized look, foot locker, expressive badge. All right, elite level dribbling, shooting, dunking, and flashy passes animations are now available for the my player. Elite level for for actually getting to 70 overall. But remember, it's also his uh, ball handling. It's your overall 
and your ball handling is what makes you be able to use those moves. So even though Elite is unlocked, I want to know if Gento is able to get them. Uh, signature emotes, my core customizing. All right, GM, microwave badge. All right, he get, he's getting a lot of stuff here, man. So, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. We went over a lot in this video. Man, Gento, thank you a bunch, bro. Like, for real, thank you a bunch. You're making my job a whole lot easier, man. But uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Let me know what type of build you're going to make in the comment section. Make sure you guys drop a like. Make sure you guys subscribe if you're new to my channel. And make sure you guys turn on notifications. It's your boy IKC signing out. Peace. Case money.